Looking at my history's a little contradictory cause all this time I wanted love but falling Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys my favorite stretching routine and this one is so amazing because I use this every single day before I go to sleep, after my workouts, as soon as I wake up, all the above. So let's get started with our first move. You are going to fold your knees to your chest and you're going to keep it there hold it tight this is going to be stretching your hips it's going to be stretching your knees now extend your left leg so that we can stretch our right hip. Now straighten your legs you're going to do a couple point and flexes and after you do a couple more of those you're going to spin your foot in circles clockwise and counterclockwise to stretch the calves Now fold your knees 90 degrees and lay it on the bed sideways. This is going to be stretching your inner thighs and also your hips. Now repeat the same for the left leg. You're going to fold your knees to your chest and keep it there. Now lift your left leg straighten it up and do your point and flexes once you do a couple more of those you're going to spiral your foot around so you can stretch your calves Now fold your legs to 90 degrees and lay it on the side. Make sure you're keeping your other hips straight. Now we're doing frog circles. You're just going to spiral your legs around like that in a circle. Now we're doing frog legs. This will help to stretch your inner thighs.
Now put down and extend one leg and you're going to put the other leg underneath your booty. This will help stretch your quads, which is really great for bulky legs. Now the other side, you're going to put your left leg underneath your booty to stretch that leg as well. Now we are doing cat and cows to stretch your back and also stretch your entire spine, your abdominal muscles. Now fold your right leg to the front and extend your left leg behind your back and you're going to stay there and hold to stretch your hips and your pelvis. Now we're on to the other side, do the same. Extend your right leg behind your back and hold that position. Now let's go to our down dog position. This will help to stretch your back thighs and also underneath your booty. If your legs are starting to hurt, just take steps. Now we are going to stretch our pelvis. You're going to fold both of your knees 90 degrees and go down to the front and extend to the back and go back to the front. You should feel the burn in your inner thighs. Now we're doing single leg pelvis stretch. You're going to extend one leg to the side and you're doing the same. Extend to the back, go to the front, extend to the back, and go to the front. Once again, you should be feeling the burn in your inner thighs. Now we're doing the same for the other leg. You're going to extend it to the side and go back to the front, extend it to the back, to the front. Now we are doing leg twists for 30 seconds. Put your right leg on top of your left leg. Now switch it to the other side. Put your left leg on top of your right leg. Now
now our next move you are going to fold your right leg to the front 90 degrees on the floor and extend your left leg to behind your back now lay your front body to the front on the floor so that you could stretch it even more. Now lift your upper body and you're going to bring your knees to your booty so you could really stretch the quads. Now change up your legs and this time you're going to fold your left leg 90 degrees to the front and extend your right leg behind your back and keep it at that position. Now lower your upper body to the front. Lift it back up and bring your foot to your booty to extend the quads. Now lay back on the floor, face up, and you're just going to shake up your legs to release all that tension. And you're done. I hope you are feeling better, you feel more stretched, you feel more relieved, you have less pain in your pelvis. Remember to do this after your workout and day and night for best results.